hello and welcome back to c programming tutorials in this video you are going to learn about how to write a c program to read three numbers from a keyboard and find out maximum out of this three using nested if else condition so this program we can write straight away but first i would like to tell you the logic behind this and how we can improve the program so first let us assume that we have three number num1 num2 and num3 now out of this three number if i want to identify which number is biggest or largest number then what we can do we can simply compare first two number so let's say we will compare this num1 and num2 and then what we will do if the number one is let's say greater than num2 then whatever will be the largest number that we will compare with the third number we have a different condition for comparison of all this number and all these comparisons are true only if all this number are not equal so if num1 is not equal to num2 is not equal to num3 then and only we can use this method and it will give a accurate answer so as i said it is a very simple thing what you need to do first you can start with let's say num1 and num2 so here we will compare if num1 is greater than num2 if it is true that means what we we want to identify the remaining number so we know that num1 is already a greater number so and the remaining number over here is what num3 so we will say check that num1 is greater than num3 or not if it is true that means num1 is a maximum number or the largest number if it is not true that means what the remaining number that num3 is our maximum number similarly here if num1 is not greater than num2 that means num2 is the maximum or the biggest number at this point now here we need to only verify that whether that num2 is greater than num3 or not if it is true that num2 is a maximum if it is not true false then num3 is a maximum so this is the simple logic so here we will write uh, if condition let's say if uh, this is true then we will check here in the if else that whether this is true or not this is the first logic but here we could have a second thing also let's say if all this number are equal in that case this logic is not going to work so for that what we need to do we need to say that all number are equal the third thing that is also possible that is let's say num1 is equal to num2 any two number can be equal it is not mentioned that they all are different okay so if num1 is equal to num2 in that case what we need to check we can take any number num1 or the num2 and we can check that whether it is greater than num3 or not if it is greater than num3 that means these two number are maximum if it is not then num3 is a maximum similarly if num2 and num3 are equal then what we will do again the same thing you can take any of this number and we can compare with the remaining number that is num1 over here and we will say that if it is true that means num2 and num3 are maximum otherwise num1 is maximum the third one is num3 and num1 can also be equal and then we will again check the same condition with the remaining number and we will say that the whether num1 and num3 are maximum or num2 is maximum so these are the all possible condition that we need to check whether out of three number which number is maximum or whether they are equal or which two number are maximum number so next we are going to write a program for this so to find out maximum out of three number we need to first take the three number from the keyboard let's say we will use the variable num1 equal to 0 num2 equal to 0 and num3 also equal to 0 these are the three variable now we will use a printf statement and we'll ask a user say lesson enter the first number 
and we will use a scanf statement to store that number into address of num1 similarly we can do this for the second and the third so i will write over here enter the second number and a third number and here we also need to change the variable 3 so now we will have the num1 num2 and num3 value from the user we need to first compare whether they are all are equal or not so if num1 is equal to num2 and num2 is equal to num3 and num1 is equal to num3 that means what all are equal we are using a logical and over here so what we need to say that printf all numbers are equal in the else condition we will use our logic now we are remaining with only those five condition in which whether the two number are equal or all of three are not equal so let's start with first condition if num1 is equal to num2 okay so that means what if they both are equal that means we are going to compare with the next number that means here if it is true that means if here we will say that if num1 is greater than num3 okay if it is true that means what we will say that num1 and 2 are maximum number so we will print f here the num1 we can print that number also person d and num2 person d are the maximum number and we can assign the variable num1 comma num2 so this is the first thing that if two number are equal then we will compare one of them that number with the remaining one and if it is true that means what that is the maximum number if it is not that means what we will say that printf num3 is the maximum number so num3 we can use the person d over here to print that value and comma num3 over here okay and what else we can do over here to ensure that each print will goes into next line we will use slash n here also slash n okay so this is the first condition that means if the num1 and num2 are equal and we have a uh, whether num1 and num2 which are maximum or num3 as a maximum the second condition i will paste it over here so let's say now num2 and num3 are equal now we need to only verify whether num2 or num3 is greater than num1 if it is true that means what that means num2 and num3 are the maximum number so here we will write num2 and num3 if it is not that means what the remaining number that means num1 is the maximum number now the third case if num1 and num3 are equal okay so now what we will say that let's say if num1 is greater than num2 if it is true that means num1 and num3 both are the maximum number so we will say num1 and num3 are maximum number or else if it is or else if it is not true that means num2 is the maximum number so these are the three if else for the uh, if the two number are equal but let's say if two number are not equal we need our simple logic so what we will say okay one more thing here we need to ensure that here instead of writing if every time we can use 
else if okay and here also we can use else if and here the fourth condition that is else e let's say now we will use our logic if num1 is greater than num2 so if it is true that means if then next we need to check that if num1 is also greater than num3 is it so if it is so then what we will say that printf num1 is a maximum number i can copy the statement i will paste it and we will say that num1 is the maximum number else num1 is not greater than num3 that means num3 is a maximum number num3 is the maximum number and similarly the last condition okay so here we have already checked that if num1 is greater than num2 or not so that means if this is not true then we will say else what are the remaining condition that means num1 is not greater than num2 so what we need to check that if num2 is greater than num3 or not if it is true then we should say that we will print f so i will just copy the print f statement we will print f and we will say that num2 is the maximum number else the last case that is we will say that num3 is the maximum number so mostly when we are writing this code we are only writing this case but above all are the extra that will help you to get the accurate answer in case if you will enter few two equal number or three equal numbers so let's run the code and check it so run the code now first i will test all three number are equal and this so here you can see that all numbers are equal okay second i will test with 10 20 and 30 so here you can see that num 3 30 is the maximum number now let me clear the screen and this time we are going to check with two equal number let's say 10 20 and 20 so you can see that num2 and num3 are the maximum number so in this way you can write a simple c program to find out the maximum numbers out of the three using if else and nested if condition thank you so much for watching this video